What if Venus had every dwarf planet in orbit around it? Okay, so we're not going to go that extreme, but what I've done for this experiment is I've put the most known dwarf planets in here. So I've got Ceres, Pluto, Eris, Haumea, Makemake, Kaoru there, Gong Gong, Orcus, Sedna. I've thrown all those in around Venus. Let's see if this works. Let's press play. And there we go. So there we go. Venus. Can it hold on? Ooh, we've already seen a bit of instability. Pluto and Eris are the most massive of the dwarf planets as well, so I'm sure they're going to have some uh, orbital uh, issues with the other moons nearby. Let's see how they behave over a longer period of time. See, the instability is already uh, definitely disrupting a lot of them. And I'm sure we're going to lose some moons eventually as well. Let's continue to speed it up. Oh, yeah, we've lost one. We're losing more. Oh, they're all falling apart. Pluto and Eris are just clearing out house here. There we go. Okay, right. So, only two moons left. That looks to be Sedna and Ceres are the only two left around Venus for this situation. Okay. Here we go. Let's see if it stays stable. And it does. There you are. Okay, so second scenario now. I've put Pluto and Iris as the furthest two of the moons. Let's see if that makes a difference. Maybe it will be a little more stable with the uh, large objects further out. Oh, it doesn't look like it. Oh, there's been a collision. Make Make took one of the other moons in. Oh, dear. There we go. Okay. Pluto's broken away already. We've probably Eris pushing it around a bit. That's gone. Okay, let's continue. Oh, it's all drama happening here. Looks like Venus has taken a bit of a beating as well. Looks like Venus is increasing temperature. Oh dear. Okay. So the other moons still kind of battling it out for position. Doesn't seem even this is stable either. The inner two moons are holding on nicely, but looks like the outer ones are not so right. I reckon we lose one more of the moons here. Let's see how it survives. Okay. Looks like Gong Gong's on the far edge. Sedna battling out with Sedna. See which one lasts. Okay. Speed up a bit more. They're really trying to hold on, aren't they? Woohoo. So four moons currently. With enough given time, they both broke each other away. And it remains just two moons once more. The two closest moons, Ceres, Haumea. The only things left around Venus. 